Hello everyone. My name is Tina, and today we are going to practice English by talking about my study routine. Let's get started and learn some new words and phrases together. Every day, I start my study routine by setting an alarm clock. I like to wake up early so I can have plenty of time to study. Waking up early helps me feel more focused and productive. Before I begin studying, I have a healthy breakfast. Eating well gives me energy and helps me concentrate better. My breakfast usually includes fruit, yogurt, and a cup of tea. The next step is to make a study schedule. I write down all the tasks I need to complete and the time I plan to spend on each task. This helps me stay organized and ensures that I use my time wisely. Having a good study environment is very important. I keep my study area tidy and make sure there is good lighting. A clean and well-lit space helps me stay focused and comfortable while studying. I start my study session by reading my textbooks. While reading, I take notes on important points. Taking notes helps me remember the information better and makes it easier to review later. Sometimes, I need to do online research for my studies. I use my computer to find articles, videos, and other resources that can help me understand the topic better. The internet is a great tool for learning. When I find important information, I highlight it. Highlighting key points helps me quickly find the information when I need to review it. It also makes my notes look more organized. Taking breaks is an important part of my study routine. After studying for about an hour, I take a short break. I might stretch, have a cup of tea, or take a quick walk. Breaks help me recharge and stay focused. For language studies, I practice speaking in front of a mirror or with a friend. Practicing speaking helps me improve my pronunciation and fluency. It's also a great way to build confidence. I also use flashcards to review important terms and concepts. Flashcards are a fun and effective way to test my memory and reinforce what I've learned. At the end of my study session, I review my notes and summarize the information I learned. Summarizing helps me understand the material better and ensures that I remember it. Finally, I close my books and organize my study area. Keeping my study space clean and organized makes it easier to start studying the next day. Now, let's take a moment to explore some new words and phrases from the story. Productive. Productive means producing we're able to produce large amounts of goods, crops, or other commodities. Example, waking up early helps me feel more focused and productive. Concentrate. Concentrate means to focus all one's attention on a particular object or activity. Example, eating well gives me energy and helps me concentrate better. Schedule. Schedule means a plan for carrying out a process or procedure, giving lists of intended events and times. Example, the next step is to make a study schedule. Organized. Organized means arranged or structured in a systematic way. Example, this helps me stay organized and ensures that I use my time wisely. Environment. Environment means the surroundings or conditions in which a person, animal, or plant lives or operates. Example, having a good study environment is very important. Notes. Notes means a brief record of facts, topics, or thoughts written down as an aid to memory. Example, while reading, I take notes on important points. Research. Research means the systematic investigation into and study of materials and sources in order to establish facts and reach new conclusions. Example, sometimes I need to do online research for my studies. Highlight. 
Highlight means to mark with a bright color to emphasize. Example, when I find important information, I highlight it. Break. Break means a pause in work or during an activity or event. Example, after studying for about an hour, I take a short break. Flashcards. Flashcards means cards bearing information used as an aid to learning. Example, I also use flashcards to review important terms and concepts. Summarize. Summarize means to give a brief statement of the main points of something. Example, at the end of my study session, I review my notes and summarize the information I learned. Thank you for joining me as I shared my study routine. I hope you found it helpful and learned some new English words. Now, it's your turn to practice talking about your study routine. Remember to speak clearly and use simple sentences. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel for more English practice videos. See you next time. Thank you for watching. Have a great day and happy studying.